This section's awfully stubby. Their cameo in Seasons of Fear, which is explained in the time of the Daleks, needs to be added on the first stage of their new empire. The Daleks invaded Car Chariot to gain knowledge data from the library on Car Chariot with their test subjects. They created the first test subject, but it went insane. However, the second test subject was able to gain knowledge from the Wetworks facility and gained a respect for non-Dalek life and refused to obey orders to kill and destroy. It was destroyed by the special weapons Dalek. The Daleks were stopped by the Seventh Doctor and his companion Ace who planted explosives which killed the Daleks and destroyed the Wetworks facility, freeing the Car Charatans. However the Dalek Supreme retreated to its mothership and reported failure to the Emperor Dalek, who was infuriated and ordered it to self-destruct. It did and the Emperor decided another plan would be completed. Audio. The Genocide Machine. Unknown to the Doctor, the Daleks gained information which they would use in their invasions including about the human mind and Project Infinity. Audio. Invasion of the Daleks, Project Infinity. The second stage of the Dalek Empire was to take control of Gallifrey. The Daleks led by the Black Dalek removed the Etra Prime from time and space so that they could mine the Apocalypse element from the planet kidnapping a Monon and Time Lord delegation including Lady President Roman Advoratra Lundar. Twenty years later the Daleks sent Etra Prime on a collision course with the planet Architrix, which was hosting a temporal treaty attended by twenty of the temporal powers. The Dalek force invaded Gallifrey and added their own mental energy to the eye, which did contain the element. The Daleks were defeated by the Sixth Doctor. Despite that defeat, the Daleks detonated the element in the Seraphia galaxy, destroying everything within it, and allowed the Daleks to establish a power base and to control over a million Scaros for their new empire. Audio. The Apocalypse Element, during the early days of the Dalek invasion and occupation of Earth in 22nd century a lone Dalek in 2158 Kansas had been damaged by weapon fire which penetrated its casing, allowing for a parasitic wasp to enter the body. Once the Dalek returned to base, it was deemed damaged and sent to the repair bay where its genetic material was to be analyzed. This was part of the Dalek's standard practice of taking the DNA to the reproductive factories for the breeding of more Daleks. It was at this point that the Dalek Emperor from an alternate future arrived and informed them of a great catastrophe that would befall them and provided them a cure, an insecticide that would prevent a so-called mutant phase from occurring. The Fifth Doctor and Nyssa arrived to help Atal Professor Tolum and his friend Ganatis for the research over the mutant phase. This had caused the Daleks' transformation into nearly indestructible creatures. The Dalek Emperor forced the Doctor to return to the 22nd century to stop the mutant phase's origins and destroyed Skaro by exploding the planet in the 43rd century when it came under attack by the mutant phase. The Emperor implanted his mind into Ganatus's to make sure Tolum and the Doctor did their work. It was the Emperor who was the cause of implementing an ineffective pesticide paradox. The Doctor convinced him not to change the past. The Emperor listened and negated the alternate timeline and the mutant phase and the Emperor was erased from existence. Audio. The mutant phase, the final stage of the Empire began when the Daleks launched over a thousand Dalek sources into the time vortex. A temporal extinction device was deployed in a time fissure by a Dalek vessel within the time vortex. This caused instability. The Dalek time ship was swamped by a tidal wave of temporal energy. They were trapped in a time loop however one pilot and two strategists arrived to General Mariah Learman after using an escape time corridor. The Daleks injected her with drugs and transformed her into a Dalek. They invaded Earth in the 17th century. These forces were stopped by the Doctor, who left them trapped in the vortex. Audio. The Time of the Daleks. The Time Lords later made a deal with the Daleks that allowed them to leave the Time Vortex. Audio. Neverland. 